So if you give a theater owner a 90 minute movie, it doesn't have to be exactly 90 minutes, they can rent the seat at 12 o'clock, 1.30, 3 o'clock, 4.30, 6 o'clock, 7.30, 9 o'clock, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, 10.30, eight times in a day they can make money. I think they like that. Go ahead, give them something about two hours or more in running time. See if they say thank you. Have you noticed the price of Blair Witch Project or Paranormal, the real cheap movies? When they come here, the, if they go into a theater, the price of admission is just about the same price as Avatar or Avenger. <laughs> Damn, we can make as much money making something for about 50,000 lei as 5 trillion lei? We figured that out 40 years ago. <laughs> You're still thinking. Thinking you're going to compete with us with, with 300 million people. Mm -hmm. So, theater on this, watch this, a two hour film, 12 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 10 o'clock, sell candy four times in a day. 90 minute film, they can make money six times in a day. So let's go get a 90 page script. Let's go get a 90 page screenplay that takes place in basically one building, one room. A stage play, a courtroom drama, a family reunion. You have local drama here, you have local theater here. Playwrights write stuff that takes place basically in one building. A bordello, a bar, a restaurant, a hotel, a reunion, some sort of a courtroom drama. So that's your priority. Let's get the great script that about 90 pages that takes place in one room. You got to watch this one. You got 10,000. If you don't get out of here right now, get a job. You're my son or daughter, you get some money in the bank. You don't talk theory and art. You get jobs and save some money, then you can make a movie. You have 10000 late. That's about $2,500. That's more than enough money to make a movie. You get a 90-page script that takes place in one room. You have your fingers? Move the typewriter? So you get 90 pages. What's that going to cost you? $5 to buy the paper? That's about it. Thank you. You're playing with me. You're a good chill for me right now. Bye-bye. Thank you for being very nice, and thank you for opening your mouth and letting me attack you. <laughs> I'm not meaning to attack you. Uh, but I, I got to kick people and get them into movement and in action that you're so used to every other nation around the world except America and now just about every other nation is the same. They're used to saying the government's got to fund the art form. We don't have that at all. So we don't depend on, we're not socialistic at all. We're very happy capitalistic. The movie industry is a capitalistic entrepreneur industry that you're going to be expanding and growing with. So you get the script. 90 pages, one location, it's a stage play, it's a reunion, it's something that happens. This is not a joke. It'll come out like a joke. We say in Hollywood, when you want to start your career and you don't know what you're doing, get a script and you take eight kids to a house and chop them up. <laughs> How many times have you seen the movie? Well, How many careers has it launched? So that's not humor. That was actually a fact, but what I just told you, and the horror genre, whatever you make that's horror, come 30 years from now, your grandchildren are still going to be renting it. They're all what we found out 80 years ago, they're lifetime, they're evergreen, they're big trees that keep making money every year, every year, every year, every year, every year, every year, for the next 50, 70 years. So that horror concept, yeah, I don't want my children going to them, but business, if I want to make money, I'm going to do that concept. But what I basically taught, or explained very quickly, your first feature film, 90 pages, take your eight actors to one location. Okay, don't chop them up, but have them talk. It's a drama. That's your first project. 90 pages, one location. Can you come up with that script? Yes, you can. That's what you're gonna focus on. You're not gonna write a script like you have all the money in the world. Hollywood people can do that. You can't do that right now. So you're going to write the script, 90 pages, one location, basically a stage play. Then you got about 10,000 light. So that's enough for a one week shoot. Any of those two, you got three video cameras over there, four. Which one do you want to use? Hey, any of you guys want a job and want to come with the camera, we call you shooters. They'll pay you $300, $500 for the week. We don't even need you for a week, we only need you for one day. So you got the script, on one day you cast. How many actors do you have here on TV that want to be in movies? Every one of them. Every one of them. But it needs an entrepreneur. That's a producer. 
So what you're going to do is get the great script. Then on Wednesday, you're going to cast the actors. Thursday, you're going to rehearse. Friday, you're going to rehearse. Then we're going to go over. We're not getting these cameras. I'm going to go get a 4K camera, at least a red. You've probably got about 10 reds in this city. And I'm going to go rent a red from somebody, and I'm going to pay him 1000 bucks for the weekend. That's maximum. And the guy will come with it because he's not going to let the red go without him coming with it. So on Saturday, we're going to go to the hotel, the bar, the restaurant, the location, rehearse again. Then on Sunday, oh yeah, camera guy, could you come to the shoot camera guy on Sunday, bring the camera. On Sunday, Sunday morning, we're going to rehearse, pay $100 for a hair and makeup person, $100 for a wardrobe person. Sunday afternoon, I'll give you $500 to bring over the camera. You're going to take it, every one of you have not been paid $500 for the afternoon. But the key aren't the cameras, it's microphones. And your microphones are too far away from me. They should be up here. You're, none of you are getting good sound now, are you? So that's amateur. I expect professional here. And we're going to have the microphones up here. I'm going to pay. Any of you know a good mic guy that got the right equipment? 300 bucks for the day. 